so what's up we got another coin unboxing so i did find this in change it's one of those uh new pennies i did order like new pennies for this year but uh they never came so might as well you know put it in here anyway so i i i, I didn't really like do, i bought these like two months ago but i never really like did anything with them so these are uh new these are some of the proof dimes to finish out this album I have. So might as well, right? I don't know I don't know where my knights are, I don't really care. Let's just get to the bottom of it. So anyway. Okay. We got we got these two dimes. Okay, so we got two proof dimes in this envelope, which is number one. Anyway, it's a C. Oops. <laughs> Oops. Okay, so this dime is a 1970. And this is a 1973. Now, I am actually planning on upgrading this folder, my whole Roosevelt dime folders, into a dance go album. Oops, it's at a some point in time. Thought it'd be a pretty cool idea. Okay. We got this dime. Ah, uh, yes. Don't know why there's a lot of staples here. Alright, I think I'm gonna just like open this up at the tape. Okay. So this is a nineteen seventy one. Uh yep, that's uh I think we have got two more in the we have the last one. all came from the same guy. I don't know why. Now, I think this is a 75. Yeah. I think I do have the 72 in my folder, so... And that's a 1975 S. So this is what I mean by the, uh... That's what I mean by this here. Now, I'm missing a lot of silver dimes still. But, uh, I got a 75, 73, 71, and 1970. Um, we're gonna use the shirt to put them all in. It's one of those, my, it's one of my dad's dirty shirts. So I might as well. Okay. Let's put it into the hole. I 
Sorry, it's like a little bit of allergies, but uh, I don't want to bang it in because these are proof coins, and I know that proof coins aren't really like they aren't really something I want to like destroy. So yeah, like I said, I'm actually thinking of buying a Dansko album for the dimes. I'm thinking maybe the next episode of the coin unboxing could be me uh, putting it all together. I think it is. I know they make still. I know they make ones for proofs, and and non ones not for proofs. So I don't wake up my neighbor downstairs because I think she was sleeping right now. It's like nine o'clock in the morning. <laughs> and I'm trying to like get this all cleared out because I just want to get this over with. Yeah, these are these are good to go, but uh we got 71. I don't know where the 70s is, it has to be here somewhere. Up oh, there it is. I see it. Right here. Anyway. Don't want to do anything stupid, you know what I mean? Oh, oh fuck. Alright, we're gonna go and, uh, Honestly, proof coins are a pain in the ass. They are a massive pain in the ass. Okay, the 72S is already in there. Well, yeah. Okay, we got the 1970S. This is the last one. This one's probably the hardest because it's way further out. Honestly, like, 1970 is one of my favorite years because due to all the, like, crazy shit that went on that year. Like, you know what I mean? We got a 70S here. And, uh, just want to bang it up a few more times. So I'm bang it anymore. Oops. I don't want to, like I said, I don't want to pick up my neighbor, but I think I did. I think this is enough to be honest. So here we go. Here's that. You can see the bang marks around the coin. Not that one, but uh, that's there's that one. First, I thought that was a bang dent, but no, that's actually the cheekbone. So we got this one. You know, if I just used a regular hammer, these would have been fucking destroyed. So, I'm glad I actually played smart. So, uh, yeah, that's the end of this video. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next coin unboxing whenever it happens. So, uh, see you guys later.